hello guys welcome back to the channel so today's video we are making this black and gold tray using items that i purchased from the dollar tree so if you're interested keep watching I am falling. I'm so deep down deep down and it's not a so for this diy you will need this four by six inch frames from the dollar tree you will need two of them You will also need these wood rings, five packs of them. So I removed the frame insets and glued the glass back onto the frames. So I only used hot glue for this part, but feel free to use Gorilla Glue or E6000 glue. So I then spray painted the back of these frames black using the Rust-Oleum flat black paint. And also I spray painted the wood rings gold using the Rust-Oleum gold metallic spray paint. I then used wood glue to glue these rings together. So I then also added a little bit of hot glue, which I did not show in this video. That way the bond would dry faster. So here I'm just using the tray to see if I needed to glue more rings and to also make sure that I was gluing these rings in a straight line. So because I used hot glue as well, which dries white, after the bond was dry, I took my clusters outside and gave them a good coat of gold spray paint. So to glue the rings to the frames, I used E6000 glue and a little bit of hot glue. So for this part of the video, I would advise you to just add the glue to the rings themselves, which you'll see in a, in a little bit how I did that. The reason why it's better to apply the hot glue to the rings themselves is that because the hot glue dries white, when you glue them to the frames, the parts that are not covered by the rings will still be showing. So I ran out of my E6000 glue in the middle of my project, so I was also using the hot glue with the Gorilla glue. So I used eight rings on the longer sides of the frames and three rings on the shorter side. So 
So to attach the other frame to the rings, I used Gorilla Glue and the hot glue. And for this part of the DIY, make sure you're only using a little bit of the glue. You don't want to use too much of it as you don't want it to drip or to seep through. So for the legs of this tray, I used wood dowels that I spray painted black. And then I glued them to the bottom of the tray using some hot glue and some of the Gorilla Glue. And here is the finished look. So let me know in the comments below guys, is this something that you would try? Are you going to attempt to do this DIY? Please let me know. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I would love to have you back. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also like this video, leave a comment below and also click that notification bell so you get notified every time when I post a video. So till next time, take care guys. But I don't know if I like